Hello everyone, welcome to the Aero App Fundamentals Training Modules. This training module will show Aero App's Moving Map features. Aero App's Moving Map is a high performance worldwide map that enables pilots to configure its display by enabling or disabling overlays. On the Moving Map screen, you will find a flight information panel located at the top view. It displays current flight information. The flight information panel displays GPS reception connection status, speed, cross track, altitude, breadcrumbs, and distance and bearing. The timer is located directly below the flight information panel. The segmented control is used to switch the timer between count up or count down and can be set in units of hours, minutes, and seconds. The reposition button allows you to move the timer button from the current position to below the ADS B button. The Air Force button is to the right of the timer button. Air Force weather is used to display METARs and TAFs in Aero App. Weather information is displayed on the route panel the information and weather option, and on the moving map. AeroApp uses standard colors for METAR conditions, specifically VFR, marginal VFR, IFR, and low IFR are displayed using green, blue, red, and magenta respectively. The ADS-B button appears in the top right of the screen. ADS-B stands for Automatic Dependent Surveillance Broadcast. An ADS-B receiver enables AeroApp to receive real-time METARs, TAFs, and other textual data as well as your own ship location. The split screen button located at the bottom of the screen enables you to view instrument approach procedure charts and user PDF documents simultaneously while viewing the moving map screen. Tap on the gray ribbon to display the chart selection. After selecting a chart, you can choose to create a markup, rotate the display, or expand the display. To close the split screen, tap the split screen button again. The move map to location enables users to search for an identifier or search term. The screen will pan to the current own ship location on the moving map. The snap to location is located to the left of the move map to location button. Snap to location enables pilots to snap to their current GPS location. The options button provides users with choices to modify their own ship view, choices for location information, show traffic on the moving map, as well as displaying different weather conditions. Toggling desired option enables the feature while disabling the option hides the feature. The Overlays button displays options to customize their moving map display. Pilots can overlay air refueling routes, arresting gear, air route traffic control sensors, flight information regions, contract fuel locations, mountainous areas, and many more. AirApp also enables users to sideload user overlays such as shapefiles and geojson files to the AeroApp directory and then display them on the moving map. The Maps button enables users to select which map to display on the moving map. Options include VFR sectionals and IFR low and high and route charts. Users can overlay helicopters and tacks directly above their map. Users can choose their desired base map as well as side loading user maps. A collapsible route panel is located to the left of the moving map screen. Tap the red route tab to expand the route panel. The route panel displays the current route. Each point includes its identifier name, frequency information, as well as distance and bearing, estimated time and route, and estimated time of arrival to the next point in the route. To add a new entry, tap on a plus sign. A dialog box will display airports, nav aids, waypoints, user waypoints, airspace, as well as pins can be entered. The new point will be added to the route and the route will be displayed in the route panel. To modify route entries, tap the edit button to move the desired point 
or to delete an entry. The route button enables users to perform route actions. Tap the route button to display the route menu. The action submenu displays options to load a route, save a route, reverse the current route, clear the current route, airdrop the current route, and file a flight plan. The add submenu displays options for adding an error fielding route, a flight plan, a preferred route, or a search and rescue pattern to the current route. The show options include showing doghouses, drop pins, point shapes, routes, and user waypoints on the moving map. The route line transparency can also be adjusted. To view the moving map's pop-up menu, long press at a location, tap an identifier, or tap a location in your route panel. The pop-up menu has actions, add, and show on the moving map options. Under the actions option, users will find create user waypoints, direct to, drop in, and add to route or remove from route choices. Add gives users the ability to add the selected location to their current route. Remove gives users the ability to remove the selected location from their current route. Under the adds option, users can add procedures and controlling obstacles. Under the show option, users can show on map, show IAP on map, show info on weather, show MVA, show nearest, and show orbit. This video concludes the overview of AeroApp's moving map features.